Hello everyone, today uh, in this video we will be talking about the quest stacking and for those who are following Cody Wumple Dad or subscribing to his channel, I know he has an update for um, regarding his original post that was posted two days ago regarding quest stacking as well as you know daily retrievals. Not everyone knows this mechanic. Uh, for those who have read this, um, you know a lot of us were confused. But today I'll be explaining what we can do, what will happen, and let's get on with the video. The first thing he said, okay, was you can retrieve two days worth of daily quests. So that's 200 daily for 60 diamonds. Before all of that, guys, the reason for why we're doing quest stacking is if you reach a certain level above the server level, there will be a penalty. As you see, when base level is a certain amount of levels higher than server level, XP reduction is applied to quests and commissions. This is really vague. There's, there's no percentage. I don't know if there's a guide out there telling us that if you're six levels above your 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 XP, I mean the XP you'll be getting on quest and commissions is, is actually deducted by 25%, so on and so forth. So going back to what he said, the first thing he said is you can retrieve two days worth of daily quests. So that's 200 dailies for 60 diamonds. Not everyone knows where you can get the daily retrieval. Is you can go to events click on daily retrieval so if you haven't done your MVP mini elite your daily commissions you can see them here and there's an option where you can retrieve it so Cody Wumple Dad actually confirmed that you can retrieve two days worth not just one but two days and you might be wondering what he said so that's 200 daily for 60 diamonds the reason why he said that is because we do have this special event called the operation commission which gives us 20 additional commission tickets and this will run up until the 20, 22nd of, of May. So if you skip the day and tomorrow, which is two days before the server level up, on the 19th, you'll be able to retrieve two days worth of everything. So that's the first thing. and. The second thing he said is you can stack three daily commission quests for the next level uh, or next server level update. This includes the fountain dance for a total of 80 commission tickets. Now you might be confused. Three commission quests. That's the limit. I mean, that's how much commission quest we can get daily. But why is it 80? Right? Because if you look at nature's gift, 20. Dance party, 20. Monster research, 20. And the limit we can get for a day are our three quests right so if you go to the dance party you will have the option to choose 15 minutes or 30 minutes so if you choose 15 minutes they will require 20 tickets but if you go for 30 minutes you will then be able to stack 40 tickets or they will require 40 tickets so right here I opted for 30 minutes because I can keep 40 tickets 20 20 so that's a total of 80 okay so that's what he said when he when when he mentioned you can stack three daily commission quests for the next level server level update this includes a fountain dance for a total of 80 commission tickets next thing he said was you will not receive stamina for life skills but you will receive 100 activity points for freya and dias right here stamina you can use it for cooking Click on that. Oh no, not this one. Confirm. You'll be routed to the laboratory or to the kitchen. Whatever you want to call it. You can also just do this. You'll be immediately sent. Not immediately sent, but you will travel um, towards where you want to forage or fish. Okay? So you won't be receiving any any stamina for the daily retrieval because you, you skip the day, okay? Now, the next thing mentioned is the XP you will receive still depends on how many levels are you below or above the server level. 
However, it will surely be more than the current XP that you will get if you finish your daily commissions. Hmm. It's kind of tricky, right? So what he meant, let me let me first explain the however. When he said, it will surely be more than the current XP that you will get if you finish your daily commissions. Meaning, if you're 6 levels or 7 levels above the server level, we all know that's, you know, you're already penalized, right? And the reason why we know this, because there are a bunch of videos out there that they're doing Hazy and Anthem, where if they're just one level sir, one level above the server level, you know, some of them were doing the quest when they were around 71, and the current server level was 70, they were receiving around a million or 600,000 or 800. Okay, for the sake of example, they were receiving a million ex base XP when doing one Anthem. And when they reached 76, or when they they were, you know, a certain level above the the server level, they were not getting the whole amount because they already penalized. You know, according to um, this information right here, base level a certain amount of levels higher, the server level XP reduction is applied to quest and commissions. Okay, so going back when he said. It will surely be more than the current XP you will get if you finish your daily commissions. If you do your daily commissions today and you're 7 levels, 8 levels above the server level, of course, of course, um, it's, it's already going to be penalized, right? Okay, just to explain things further. When he said the XP you will receive still depends on how many levels you are below or above the server level is when you retrieve when you retrieve the skipped dailies that you did today and tomorrow well since it's already 17th we will be skipping tomorrow because today we are stacking or you can either you know do any anything you want you you might want to skip today and just stack tomorrow but anyways going back to what he said if you retrieve the dailies on the server level you will re you will you will get more experience as compared to you doing your dailies today and tomorrow right because the server level hasn't happened yet. i mean the server level up hasn't happened yet it's going to happen on the 19th so if you're doing your daily quest today and tomorrow 17 and 18 and the server level is still at 70 and you're around 76 or 77 you're gonna get less experience as compared to your retrieving your skip dailies on the 19th and abandoning these quests for an extra 80 tickets and just using it on the 19th. Of course, you'll get more experience because the server has already leveled up and you're not mat you're not much higher. Your, your level is not that high as compared to the server level. I hope that clears everything out. Again, for Filipino watchers, feel free to comment in Tagalog. And the reason why I'm speaking uh, English is just to cater uh, to everyone and I'm really not fluent in Tagalog because I am Bisaya, I am from Cebu. I apologize. But feel free to comment, you know, in those languages that I know. So for HHH or HHN, he said it can be scheduled after the server update for more XP. That's very obvious, guys. You can run two Helheim daily and eight weekly. So since the server level is up this Friday, we we have three days to consume our Helheim. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And the reason why you're seeing two slash eight because I already consumed two today. Because again, the server levels up this Friday, May 19th, at least in the Philippines. That's what it says here. We have different time zones. I've tried it. Going back to the Helheim runs, just consume two of your runs today and Friday, Saturday, and Sunday do it. Again, if it doesn't really matter to you, just go ahead and do your runs today or probably since it's already a Wednesday you probably consume six you have two left for tomorrow it totally depends on you because after the because right now I'm recording after uh, the server update which you know the monk is already released on the patch notes it says the level 80 blueprint is now available so I mean, if you guys want to go ahead and uh, grab one while it's hot, go ahead. I won't stop you. But but the experience, you know, the experience you'll be getting is 
you know, gonna be much lesser if you wait, if you don't wait for the server level up. Okay? So, the last thing he said is the server level update will be different for each server. That's what I mentioned earlier, but remember that you can do this two days before the actual update. So, what will happen on the 19th? You guys, what will happen on the 19th? On the 19th, since for, for most of us, if we just started stacking today, we will be abandoning these three quests on the 19th. So that'll give us an additional 80 tickets. Okay? So since the event is still going on, on the 19th, we, we will have a total of 180 tickets, which we can consume for Anthem and Hazy. And for everyone who, who might be wondering what will I do with the extra tickets, because you can only run Anthem twice, as you can see, completions 2, Hazy completions 1, one 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 but you know so if we count that out you know after hazy and anthem that's already 80 right 100 120 140 160 180 you can even consume twice here i know it's it's really um for others they're saying it's not worth it because it's it's too manual but don't forget there's a skip ticket right here. If you click on that, go to the diamond shop. How much is it? It's, it's only three diamonds, guys. Come on. You can buy 10 for 30. And if you go to MVP or if you do your five MVPs daily, if you don't, even if you don't have a party, you'll receive an illusion card, card fragment, which you can sell for 30 diamonds, right? So again, this, this quest stacking is, is not for everyone if you think it's just gonna be a waste of your time go ahead but I'm at you know I'm telling you guys there's a skip ticket which you can take advantage of okay so just to um, summarize everything uh, you can retrieve two days worth of daily quest that has been confirmed so that's a total of 200 daily for 60 diamonds and when he mentioned dailies perhaps you don't want to skip your demon treasure your cat paw caravan, your alfheim, because when you start your day, it's 0 20 for your alfheim. You click on that, you click go, you click claim. You do that every day, okay? Don't forget that. Uh, going back, that would be your uh, elite MVP mini. Just do that every day. Uh, your Battle of Yggdrasil, I suggest you do it this Saturday or Friday for for more XP. Um, so don't don't sleep on that. Do everything except for your daily commissions okay so if you just started this today if you've just watched the video uh stack 80 today since you can only uh get three commission quests and the dance party again it has an option for you to do it for 30 minutes which will require 40 tickets and two more so that's a total of 80 okay um three daily commission quests yep uh, two days worth you will not receive stamina for for life skills but you receive 100 activity points the XP you'll receive still depends on how many levels are you below or above the server level however it will surely be more than the current XP that you will get if you finish your daily commissions I've explained it earlier if you do everything now you will get lesser experience because of the penalty but if you're retrieving it upon server level up you're just you're closer your level is closer than the server level so of course it won't have a penalty so you get more xp if you retrieve your your commissions or you retrieve your your skip days okay again for this case we'll only be skipping once because the day will be stacking them and abandoning them on the 19th helheim runs feel free to do so since this this update will already provide level 80 blueprints if you're in a rush for some reason i don't know why Go ahead if you're already at level 80 feel free to do so if you if you don't really care much about experience um also lastly the server level update will be different for each server but remember that you can do this two days before the actual update so if you have questions feel free to comment down below or go to his channel straight to the community he has this post um just comment directly under that post because he replies to all those posts me I'm just creating this video to to clarify some things again for the Filipinos out there or for 
the Bisaya out there, pag comment lang mo, just comment down below um, if you're still confused. I will do my best to help you out. Okay? So that's it for today, guys. I hope you guys are enlightened more of the current situation. For those who are treating this as something important, this is how you do it. Okay? So that's it for today's video, guys. It's kind of lengthy, but I hope everyone is less confused. Thank you so much for watching, guys. That's it for today. Happy leveling and rock on.